just now. I'm not a hundred percent a big fan of this setup. So the trick is you put your, the first bolt in, and then just and the, and the top one, and just hook it on, and then then do it up. Now the reason I did take it off is because I don't like this sticking up. This protrudes higher than the bar, the draw bar. So because this protrudes higher than the draw bar, if you fall, you're going to hit your head on that. Rotate that. And I'll do it again. Simple as. Now let's pull it out. Ah, let's have a look at that. It's an interesting feature. Pull it out. And then the um, handle goes in. And should get you out of trouble. Okay, I just want to point out that this jockey wheel also indicates um, four inches up, that it has a maximum recommended height that you should extend it. So just make just be aware of that. Um, you can adjust with this, this, these two pins, the height travels up and down. So you just be mindful, you don't want to extend the jockey wheel too far. Max moving height with the indication line. So. As you can see, I've just cleared my uh, hitch, hitch pin. So, so another tip, you might extend past the max moving height just to disconnect from the vehicle. So once you've disconnected, then you just level your camper or caravan. And you can bring it back down to the required height, the minimum anyway. And you can always double check and make sure you level off your um, spirit bubble. So I can come back down off even further. So it's well within the range. And that should do it. I'm just going to finish off this video. Um, during the recording, I did cover the mic. So yeah, this locking pin locks the wheel in position when you when you pack it up, so it doesn't swing while travelling. And the other thing is, I wasn't a huge fan of the um, the brackets protruding past the drawbar, so the one solution that I have in mind is to get a block of hardwood timber and just have it there and then cover in between these pieces because 
I just feel that um, if anyone was to fall or trip near this near this end of the um, camper trail, especially kids and stuff like that, you hit your head on that, you're gone. Okay, so that's probably the only slight design issue I have with this jockey wheel. But overall, it's it's functionable uh, and it works, and it seems to be a lot sturdy compared to the cheaper versions out there. So if um, Arc the company could um, supply something to um, fit in here that sits, that'd be a, a better option.